What's up guys and welcome back to another unboxing video or opening video really it's more really uh, opening than unboxing but it is a box so I suppose it is a opening uh, unboxing video as well uh, I have a steam siege as you can tell a booster box here I know I only did like a booster box opening last week that was like you know this this time last week uh, and that was obviously for Fates Collide but steam siege came out literally uh, Wednesday I think it was so I f I was sort of I, was, I wasn't going to buy one for a while, you know, give, give it a month or so, and I was going to buy one in, but I couldn't help myself, um, I thought, you know, I can order one now and it come for Friday, so I can do it after I get home from work, and yes, there we go, we have Steam Siege booster box to open, and my camera is just terribly focusing once more. There we go, okay, so we are going to open this up, as you might be able to tell if I open the box up, oh, that's a really cool opening there. Uh, I have cut the tops off all the packs as was just in the comment section uh, last uh, of the last um, opening. Um, just makes it easier because now I can basically pull the pack out and then pull the cards out, you know, right there. So that's what I shall be doing. And yeah, I guess we're gonna jump straight into it. This this um this, this set has some really cool cards in it, so hopefully we'll get some of those. And hopefully the camera will be, will be good for us today. Gonna be good camera. Hopefully it'll be good. Cool. Right. Well, let's just let's just get started. Now I can open it from the front. Uh, or not open it from the front, but you know, take the cards out from the front. It's already open. If I can even get my card, get the cards out. This is an extra one. I have opened the card. You know, I have you know opened or cut the packs open, so I can get the cards, and then I have to actually pull them out. So that's uh, another another task there. So uh, code card. There we are. One, two, three. This is my first opening of boosters. You know, this set not entirely. I haven't seen a single card for the set yet, so it'll be interesting to see what we get here. Because you know, we'll just see. Ooh, we start off with Zwilus. That's really cool. Um, there we go, Zwilus. Lovely. That's cool. Uh, I'll take a Zwilus. You know, <laughs> we have a Drift Blim as well. Okay. Um, I mean, I don't know. You know, these obviously are uncommon, so there's nothing too special here. Uh, a God of our Spirit Link. That's a Mega God of our. So hopefully we get one of those. Who knows? Uh, we have ourselves a Ponytail. That looks really cool. Uh, I'm trying to get the, the camera to focus, but there we go. That's cool. And we have a Dano, so we have you know two out of three of this evolution line in the first pack already. Litwick, that's pretty cool. Nose pass, that's some really funky little art for him there. He's looking pretty suspicious. And Chimchar holding a gear in his head because obviously it's a Steam Siege. All about the gears. We have our Reverse Bastiodon, that looks cool. I like that Reverse Bastiodon quite a lot. I'm not going to complain. And finally, our first rare is a Pyro. That's pretty cool. Not any, not a hollow or anything, but a Pyro nonetheless. That's pretty cool. Uh, one, one tip I can give you guys if you want to watch this video. You might look at the video and say, oh my god, it's 40 minutes long. I don't know how long it's going to be. But, you, know, you might look at it and say, oh, it's 40 minutes long. I can't watch the whole of this. No, don't want to watch the whole of it, but watch it on two times speed because I'm sure... Um, you know, I, I could 1.5. You know, uh, that would be a pretty good tip. I know one of my friends did that because you know I'm not worth it for full time. Uh, <laughs> nah, it's a pretty good tip. You know, obviously I can't two speed this because it is pretty hard. You know, to go fast sometimes and get you know, stuff focusing on that. But you guys can you know speed me up basically. Speed me up, Scotty. That's it. It's not right, but yeah, speed me up, Scotty is the way to go. One, two, three, and we have ourselves a Sagibloom. There we are, Skip Blue. Claw Fossil Anarif, so there's Anarif and Armada in this set, obviously, as well as Leaping and Cranity. Another Zwilus, so that's two of those already. Fungus, with those, it's like a real life image, that one, isn't it? Uh, that's pretty cool. Bergmite, funky, 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 funky. Joltic, that's another real life image, I think. Or well, it looks like it, at least. Um, looks like you just get you know, the little clay dolls and put them in the, uh, in the, you know, the nature, <laughs> the wildlife, I don't know. Mantine, pretty cool there. Clink, so you know, gears again, focusing there. A reverse Nidoran male, okay, that's pretty cool. Not going to there. And finally, our rare is, oh, it's a Galvantula, our first dual type card. This set does have dual types in it. I think there's about, I don't know, I don't, know, I don't want to give a number off the top of my head. I was going to say 16, but I'm sure it's not that many. But our first dual type card, that's really funky. Nice electric grass type there for Galvantula. So he is pretty cool. Still, obviously, we're only two packs in out of um, how many packs are there here? 36. 36 packs in a booster box. I'm just trying to straighten these cards up so I don't fall over. 36 packs in a booster box, so we're two out of 36 in. Um, so, we have a long time to go, plenty more time to get some rares. So, let's 
hopefully get these cards out. It still takes me a little while to get the cards out of the pack because they do tend to stick, whereas when I'm opening them normally, they uh, they can fall at the back. But we have a Fletchinder, a sweet Fletchinder. I'm guessing the whole the whole line is here. Another Skip Bloom, another Claw Fossil Anoreth, great. A Pawniard, looking pretty cool. I know um, Bisharp is a dual type in this set, so hopefully we'll get him. Fungus, a Rufflet, Litleo, funky. A Mario, fairy type here. Again, Azumarill is a dual type in this set, so that's pretty cool. A Dewatt, and of course, uh, it's a reverse Dewatt as well. Um, the Azumarill is actually a shiny Azumarill too, so that's really funky. And our rare is a Drudigan. That art looks really cool, actually. I really do quite like that art. My hand is shaking a little bit, but yeah. There we are. It's not going to focus again. But yeah, pretty funky there. Loads of dragon types in this set, it would seem. Um, you know, you, I mean, Fates Collide, I'm pretty sure, has one dragon type in it. Uh, and that is the Kingdra EX. I'm pretty sure it's an EX. So there seem to be a lot more dragon types in uh, in Steam Siege. Obviously, dragon's like one of the rarest types, but you know, still, there's a lot of types, uh, a lot of dragon types I've seen already out of just a f you know, three packs, basically. Uh, yep, yeah, it is pretty hard to get these cards out still because they are sticking to the insides. I almost don't want to, you know, see, because I cut the tops off, I don't want to have to rip the cut, rip, rip the pack open because I can keep it intact. But um, it's still a little tricky. So, what's next? We have a captivating poker buff because who doesn't love those? Oh, a Zoomerill. It's only an uncommon. It's uncommon? Yeah, it's an uncommon. What the hell? A Zoomerill, uncommon, dual type, as I said, and it's a shiny Zoomerill too. I'm not sure, I'm not, uh, why is that not a hollow? I don't know. Anyway, Fletchinder again. We have an Apom. Funky, funky Apoms there. Larvesta. That's pretty cool. He's a grass type rather than a fire type as well. Another Dano. Shellos. We have ourselves. Oops. Can't get it. There we go. Yes, I can see a card there. Mankey. Funky. Reverse Rufflet. So that's both And we have ourselves Magiana. We have. I was about to say Magiana then, but I corrected myself. Uh, in time, we have Mag Mag Magina EX. That's really cool. Number 75 out of 114. Obviously, it's not a full art, but that looks really cool still. My first Generation 7 card, because obviously, M M Magina is a Generation 7 Pokemon. So that's really, really funky. That's pretty cool there. That's our first good pull. I'm going to hopefully keep those uh, those packs separate so I can actually show off the pulls at the end. Whereas la you know, last episode, I sort of, I, I, I didn't. Um, well, not last episode, but last time I did this unboxing, I didn't. I, I just sort of said, this is what I got. I can't show you, but this is what I got. So, yeah. We have a Lampant. Sweet Lampant. Okay. Little Lampant now. Captain Poke Buff. Another Azumarill. Damn. So, I guess he's not actually that rare. I thought he'd be more rare. Another Shadows. Krogunk. Sweet. Tangela. Hanging from the tree. Tangled up there. I think that was, yeah. Just making sure I didn't skip a card. Clink. Joltic once more. A reverse Litleo. That's funky. Don't think I have one of those. No, I don't. Of course not. And we have, ooh, a hollow Xerneas. Oh, that's cool. I like that. I know Xerneas and the Eveltal Break are in the Steam Siege pack, so maybe we'll see one of those. But yes, that's a nice hollow Xerneas there. You can see the rainbow you know, shiny off the back. Um, I don't class that as a pull, really, because obviously it's only a hollow. The ones you want to focus on are EXs and... Um, Full arts and, and stuff like that, so I'm going to keep that separate and not have it in the, the pull set, I guess, if you want to call it that. Um, but that's a pretty good pull, yeah. I, I do like quite like that. It's a legendary Pokemon, generally, you know, I, I would say legendary Pokemon are, are, are nice pulls to get. Obviously, they're not necessarily amazing all the time. Like Moltres for Fates Collide was just a normal card, it wasn't even a hollow card, um, but it's still pretty cool. So, hopefully, I'm not moving the camera there. I have a cable running across here, might be getting in my way. But next up we have a Tangrowth, so the whole evolution line there, Tangler and Tangrowth there. Horlucha, so another Horlucha card. Uh, Lampant, Maril, Yanma, looking pretty funky. A Fletchling, okay, so that's two Fletching and Fletchinder. Mareep, sweet. Drifloon, a Reverse Crow Gunk, I'm not going to complain there. And we have ourselves a Bastiodon, so we got a reverse Bastiod in the first pack, so yeah. Both types of Bastiod on there, not too bad I suppose. I won't complain of that, obviously. And we'll get the next pack out again. Hopefully I'm gonna, I'm gonna, uh, yeah. Okay, so you got to pull from the bottom of the pack, not from the top of the pack. Because obviously trying to pull the cards out with like little to no space to move your fingers isn't very easy. Whereas you can pull the bottom of the pack right off. Amber Palm, sweet. Tangrowth again. Pull Lucha once more. Sneasel, looking, looking pretty playful there. C dot, sweet. 
Drifloon, I know our Shiftry here is a Grass Dark one, I think. Uh, dual type Apom, another Mankey, a Reverse Weavile, that looks cool. I think the Reverse Dark type cards look really, really funky all the time, like the Tyranitar we got in Fates Collide. Uh, really funky, and the rare is a Volcarona, which is obviously, yet again, a dual type, a grass fire type. Sweet, that's pretty cool. Again, not really classing as a pool though, just nice little cards. These are, these are, these are cards you, you get in most packs, or not most packs, you know, they're not rare. They might be, uh, well, they are, they are called rares, but, you know, um, just go around. they're not like really rare pools, I suppose. You get a rare in every pack, but the rare can be a rare rare, or it can just be a normal rare, so. I'm just ram rambling on here while I open packs. But we have a Monferno. He looks really cool scaling the side of that wall. Looks like Attack on Titan style. <laughs> shield on, so there's you know, pre evolution there. Maybe uh, maybe Leap isn't in this set. Maybe we have Shield on and on instead. And the Pom. Hop it to go along with the Skip Blooms we had. Nose Pass once more. Nidoran Mail to go with the reverse one of it. Litleo to go with the reverse one of that. Sneasel, another Sneasel there. A reverse Pokemon Ranger, okay, not, not, gonna, not gonna complain there. And then our rare is a Yan Mega. Sweet, okay. So we've had one, you know, one good pull, I would say. You know, I, I'm gonna class an EX as a, as a good pull. Um, we haven't really had any amazing pulls yet, i.e. full arts or secret rares. I think there are two secret rares for this set, so if I get even one of them in this booster pack, I'll be we'll booster box, I'll be really quite pleased. Greed Dice. Oops, Greed Dice apparently is a really good card if you play the game. Uh, you can play this card only if you took it as a face down prize card before you put it in your hand. Flip the coin, if heads, take one more prize card. So, I don't know. Apparently, it's pretty good. Monferno, Shield on, Mantine, so stuff we had before. Meowth, that's a new card for this set there. Larvesta, Fletchling again. Oshawott, Oshawott! Reverse Mareep, sweet, and. Oh! oh, oh, oh. It's a shiny Mega Guard of War EX Full Art, 112 out of 114. That is beastly. I like that quite a lot. I am, I am, yes, I love it. There is a card, I think, I think it's just a normal Mega Guard of War. It's got both a normal and a Mega in it, in the art. That's just a normal one, not a full art. Uh, and I think there's, I can't remember if, if there's a Guard of War Secret Rare in this set. I think there is as well. And then there's a, Vulca a Volcanian Secret Rare, but I don't know what the other one is, can't remember. But that looks really cool. So that will go in the pull section, obviously, because it's a full art, and it's just Mega Gardevoir, who is awesome. They've done so many Mega Gardevoir cards, so that is my only um, criticism. Like, she appears in another set again, she's already been in Mega Evolution previously. Yes, okay, she's shiny now, that's pretty cool. But she's been used previously, whereas some Mega Evolutions, like Beedrill, have not even had cards for them yet. So uh, that's pretty disappointing, especially since it looks like we might be moving away from them uh, in Sun and Moon. Who knows that? Rapidash, pretty cool. Persian, you know, fully evolved here. Another greedy dice. Dano, once more. Chimchar, we've had him before. Rufflet. Clauncher, sweet, that's a new one. Meowth, once more. Reverse Nuzleaf, pretty cool. And the rare is a Avalug to go along with the Bergmite. He's actually got a couple of Bergmites on his back, so, you know, just chilling with the, uh, with the squad there, obviously. So, well, let's go. We're not even halfway through yet. We've had two pretty good pulls. Um, well, we said the Magena was going to be a good pull, not another pretty good pull, or an amazing pull. But we had one really good pull, so I'm quite happy with that uh, Mega God of War full art. You know, uh, she's a funky girl. Or a guy, who knows. Ninja Boy! New card for in this set here. Rapidash. Persian again. Damn. Sea Dot again. Clauncher again. Bergmite once more. Yanima once more. Mareep, the reverse hollow is a Clauncher Break, or Claw it's, a, Claw it's a Break rather, uh, this is the reverse hollow, for some reason they always pay, appear as reverse hollows for me, so maybe they're supposed to be reverse hollows, who knows, and the rare is going to be a Cabalium, sweet, that's another legendary, again, he's not a hollow, he's just a normal Cabalium, so, um, you know, that he, it is what it is, but he is a pull, so I shall put Claw It's there, sweet. So that's three pulls we can show off before we're even halfway through. I mean, in um, in the Fates Collide one, we got two full arts. We got uh, three breaks, I think it was, and then we got four EXs, if I remember correctly. So, I mean, that was pretty good. So, I don't know if we'll get better than that. Who knows though? Normal Pokemon Ranger, Alarith, sweet Ninja Boy, Punita, Marill, Oshawott again, Krogunk once more, Tangela, Reverse Sneasel. So we had a Reverse Weevil. Now we've had a Reverse Sneasel. So. That matches up if the camera will focus. Come on, camera, you know you want to focus. You've focused before. 
You've done this before, who knows? Oh well. And the revert rare is a Shiftry, which is a hollow. It's a dual type hollow. There we go. Looks pretty funky again, a hollow. Nice and funky there. Sweet. Not a, not a really good pull, but a hollow I will take nonetheless. So, there we go. I think I like to do when I open packs is I like to open them or keep them in the same order as I open them in. So, like, you know, I can look through again after, I guess. It's a bit weird. Um, so I'm trying to keep it all in order, even though I'm keeping some packs off to the side. So it's it's a bit challenging, I suppose, but we will get there in the end. So what do we got next? We have Nuzleaf, yeah, funky Nuzleaf, Pokemon Ranger again, Anarith, Litwick, Hoppip, Dano, Litleo, Nosepass, Reverse Cabalion. Ah ha ha! So we have both Cabalion and Reverse Cabalion. Sweet. And then finally, the rare is a Primeape. So. Not as exciting, but I shall take it because, you know, I like collecting the cards, basically. I, I'm, I'm not in it for playing the game or whatever. Uh, I do like collecting cards and getting the set, basically. Fates Collide, I'm always complete on the set. The only thing I have, like, I think six cards left I don't have in, you know, normal, in the normal versions, which are mostly EXs and full arts, so I can't complain there too much. But we have ourselves a Braviary next. Sweet. Armor Fossil Shieldon, so yeah, the Shieldon's Fossil there. Nuzleaf, Mareep, Bergmite, Fungus, Joltik, Litwick, Reverse Hoppip, so in that, that, yeah, pretty cool. And the rare is a Probo Pass. Again, haven't had Probo Pass before, so I shall take it. I shall take it, I say! How far are we through now? We have one, two, three, four packs left of this half, I think, so we are about uh, maths time now. There's 36 in total, which means 18 on each half, 4 left, which means we're about an 8 through, uh, of, no, not an 8, 3 uh, three eighths through of the total unbox and opening, rather. Who knows? But next up, we have ourselves a Dewat. We have a reverse Dewat, I think, so that's pretty cool. Matches up there. Bravier again. Arm the Fossil Shield in again. With the camera will focus. Who knows? Joltik. Larvesta. Rufflet. Ponyta. Meowth. A reverse Flaffy, so we have both a reverse Meep and a reverse Flaffy. I'm going to move my hands away and bring it back so it can focus again, hopefully. Come on, camera. There we are. I'm just got to reset the focus. Flaffy, and behind it we see a Mega Steelix EX. Not a full art, just a normal one, 60 out of 1 for 4, but he is shiny as you can see, and he's pretty funky, pretty cool there. Uh, you know, as I said, not a revert, not a full art, but looks pretty cool nonetheless. Another pull, and he's a dual type as well. I didn't notice that to them. He is a steel fighting type, sweet. Or steel, I don't know if they're like different, called different types, like metal. I think they are. Uh, steel is metal, and um, fight must be like fight. I guess it's fight still. Just uh, steel and metal are a bit different, because cause they are. Don't ask me why, it's just how it rolls. You can ask uh, the, the people behind the trading card game. I don't know why there aren't 18 different types, because I guess that would be really hard to do a trading card game on. Who knows though? Next up we have Clang, so we have a couple of Kalinks, and now we have a Clang. Claw Fossil Anarif again, Dewat once more, Larvesta, Drifloon, and before, Pawniard, C Dot, camera stopped focusing again, oh well. Clink, a reverse special charge, that's pretty cool, haven't seen him before, camera come on. There we go, special charge, who knows? And then the rare is a hot an Ampharos and it's hollow Ampharos too, so that's pretty funky. Uh, see, some some Pokemon you wouldn't think would get hollows, get hollows like Ampharos, like I wouldn't say. Yes, it's, it's a cool card and all, but I wouldn't say it's like a hollow worthy card. Um, whereas Cobalion, yeah, yeah, it's legendary, why not give it hollow? No, apparently not. So, again, who knows what goes on at the Pokemon TCG company. It's not really a company. Pokemon TCG, TCG division, maybe that's what's called, who knows. But... Let us continue uh, once more. We have Special Charge Normal this time, so, yep, both of those. Another Clang, Claw Fossil Iron Riff, Fungus, Nidoran Male, there we are. Oshawa again, Pawniard once more, Tangela, a Reverse Shellos, so that's pretty cool, we have another there. And then we have our shells, a Claw Itza, so we have a Claw Itza Break, and now a normal Claw Itza, so. Pretty cool once more, I'll take it. And we have one pack left, and that is the first half complete once this is done. So we've had four good pulls from this half. So that's, you know, I won't complain that. Um, thinking back to what we had, you know, Fates Collide was two full arts, three breaks, and four EXs. So that's what? It's nine in total. So we're almost like half there. 
Zuilas. Nidorino. Matches the need around there. Special Charge. Sneasel. Mantine. Mankey. Yanma. Apom. Having a uh, play around there. A reverse Drift Blim. There we go. And the rare is a Toxicroak. I like that art. He looks really cool because he has poison coming out of his. his I don't know, Fang, whatever you want to call it, it's Spike, that's really cool. But no, nothing special there, and that's halfway through, so let's continue. We have, boom, halfway to go, or half more left, whatever you want to call it, I don't know. So yeah, this is my first time like starting a set off by opening a booster box. Usually, I mean, I mean, I can't say usually, I've only just started collecting. So previously, I had obviously Deck Maniacs boxes to start off my collection of Face Clyde. As well as Breakpoint, so really I've been starting off with like a theme. I mean, Fate Sky was started off with a theme deck as well as a couple booster packs, so there was that. I should have bought a theme deck with this, really, but oh well. We have Shielden, Zuilas, Nidorino, Marrow, Shellos, Mantine, Plink, Mankey, Reverse Mankey, go with it, and then we have Gastro. I dropped Gastro Gastrodon, Gastrodon to go along with the Shelloses. There we go, all good. Right, okay, let's continue there. Bum, bum, bum. Reverse, or, oh, no, it's not reverse, it's <laughs> Xerneas Break packs. There are four different packs here. We have a Volcanion, obviously, Mega Gardevoir, a shiny Mega Gardevoir, and then a Xerneas and Eveltal Break, because we finally get around to those breaks. We have a normal Flaffy to go along with the reverse we had earlier, Steelix Spirit Link to go the Mega Steelix we have, Shield on, Shield on, Chimchar, Nidoran again, Plauncher, Fletchling, Hoppip, a reverse nose pass, that's pretty cool. And then the rare is oh, I dropped it. The rare is Eveltal. Oh, I dropped it as well. No cool reveal for Eveltal here. That's pretty cool. Again it is hollow. So we have we have both Xerneas and Eveltal here in the hollows. That's pretty cool. I'm not gonna complain. Um, there are only hollows, but I still do like hollows. They are pretty funky. And that's the first pack of the second half as well, so not complaining there. It's not like we have to wait ages. I'm trying to get these cards out. It is, it is a tricky business. I'm ripping the back of this pack while I'm doing this, but I'm getting there. Oh, there we are. This doesn't help that it's fairly humid today, so the cards are probably sticking to the packs like that a little bit. But we have a captivating Pokebuff. Another Flaffy. Still experiencing again. A bomb. Clauncher. Fletchling. C dot, Drifloon, Reverse Chimchar, that's pretty cool, I do it, I do like myself a Chimchar, and then we have the rare is an Amoongus, so yeah, goes along with, goes along with the Fungus we have, if we have more, more, you know, some more than one Fungus, who knows, but starting to actually get quite far away from uh, my position when I'm putting these cards across, like laying them out basically, so uh, might be interesting to see how we get on from here on out. I can also get the cards out of the pack too. There we are. There we go. Two, three. Okay, once more we have Lampant. Clef key. That's pretty cool. Loads of keys. Even maybe even more keys than he actually he can he he can open his keys up, his keychain up. Sweet. I mean, obviously he has to get the keys on there somehow, but you get what I mean. Marrow, Ponyta, Dano. Litwick, Nosepass, Reverse Rapidash, that's pretty cool, and the rare is in Armaldo. So Armaldo, oh yeah, we, we knew our Anarif and Armaldo were in these packs, in, in, in the set rather. I was thinking about Lilip and Crowdly. It's not going to focus, but it's just an Armaldo, so we'll, we'll leave it be. We'll leave Armaldo be. So, next up we have... Well, I can see... I, <laughs> I always like saying, you know, next up we've got this, you know, but it's just next that we have, oh, it's just, it's just another pack, okay. Well, that's no fun at all, is it? Just another pack. So, one, two, three. Da, da, da. What's up first? We have ourselves a God of our Spirit Link. Already have one, but we'll take another, I suppose. Lampant. Clefki again. Obviously, I prefer cards I haven't got before, but what can you do? Chimchar. Nosepass. Litlio again. Sneasel. Yanma, reverse Yanma to go along with it, and the rare is oh, ha, 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 the other Gardevoir full art. We have a Gardevoir EX full art. I'm gonna have to do this. Um, we have yeah, we have the main Gardevoir full art, and then we have the EX or the normal one to go with it. Really, really freaking cool. 111. So 
God of War just loves us, guys. You know, God of War just, you know, wants to hang around with us. So, you know, I'm not going to complain there at all. At all. Two God of Wars, and we have God of War Spirit Link in the same pack to link them up. So, that is cool. That is very cool. Two full arts, so exactly the same as what we had from Fitz Collide booster box last week, so that's pretty pretty cool, pretty funky there. And oh, oh, I dropped all the cards. Damn it! <laughs> I was pulling out of the pack and I dropped the cards, guys. So the order is going to be really messed up for this pack, um, but we'll just we'll just we'll just do it how it is. I don't know what's going to happen. We're starting off with a Ponyard so we're on the comments here. I lost my grip. There we go, Ponyard, Fungus. Rufflet, then we have another Litlio for Cool Commons. Joltik is here. We have a Reverse Drudigan as our Reverse. Obviously, there's more to come here, so the Rare is going to be behind this one. Yep, we have Volcanian. Yes, Volcanian is pretty powerful. Not a you know an EX or anything. There is a Volcanian EX in the pack, and there's also a Full Art Volcanian and a I think a Secret um, a Secret Rare as well. So lots of Volcanian. Hopefully, we'll see some more of that though. Fletchinda, Tangrowth. And God of War Spirit Link again. I completely screwed that. Okay, so Tango, Fletchinder, and Volcanion goes at the back. And we'll put this through there. Okay, it's in the right order, guys. I fixed it. Okay, we'll just try try not to drop any more packs, basically. Uh, keep it because it's because some of the cards obviously are, are more pushed out than the others because of the edges of the bottom of the pack themselves. So when I'm holding them, obviously I'm holding the yeah. You know, there's more force on. Oh, damn it. More force on the outer cards than on the inner cards, and the inner cards can, I guess, slip through. Physics in action, guys. Physics in action. So, next up we have Drift Blame, Legenda, Tangrowth once more, Crow Gunk, Mareep, Litwick, Hoppip, Meowth, a reverse Meowth to go along. Have, have we already had a reverse Meowth in this, <laughs> in this booster box? I don't know. Reverse Meowth, and then the rare is another Yan Mega. It peeks out behind before I could show it, but you guys get the idea. So, let's keep on going. I want to get like a Volcanion EX or a, a Full Art one of them because they are. It is really cool. Um, we have we have McGinnis go along with it as well, guys. Come on now, you know. Fits up with the film. Fits up with the film. McGinnis and Volcanion. Come on. Do me proud, Booster Box. Do me proud. Okay. We had another of these. Let's do shiny zoom rules. There we go. Greedy dice again. Drift Blim once more. Loads of Drift Blim. Mankey. Shellos. Krogunk, Tangela, Clink, a reverse Nidorino, so we're both reverse Nidoran, male and Nidorino, and the rare is another Galvantula, so I'm not going to complain, but I would have preferred a different card, because as I said, I do like collecting, so uh, dupes aren't that useful to me, especially since I'm not like in school anymore. If I was in school and everyone was collecting Pokemon cards still, that would be amazing, since obviously I'd be able to like you know, trade all my dupes away uh, to some kid that was you know wanting to catch them all, basically. Um, but alas, I'm not in school anymore, so I just have piles and piles of dupes, and that's that. Ninja Boy, Ninja Boy, Ninja Boy, Ninja Boy. Another Azumarill, four of those are now. Greedy Dice, Ponyta, Ponyard, Oshawott, Rufflet, Tangela, a Reverse Clauncher, so, you know, I'll take it. And the rare is an Infernape Hollow. I need to reset this again. But Hollow Infernape, that's a really cool card. I do like that indeed. Any Hollow card is pretty cool, to be honest. Um, they all have a nice shiny background. So, uh, I don't know how long we have left. Probably about a quarter of the booster box left. Come on, boys. Give me a Volcanian. Give me a Volcanian. Secret Raya, come on. I've been pretty lucky, really. I, one of my, my my one secret rare that I have, which is the Alakazam from Fates Collide, was gotten in one of my booster packs from Deck Maniacs. And obviously, you know, Secret Rare is a Secret Rare, so... Maybe we'll get another one, who knows. Claw Fossil, Amarith, Skiploom, Ninja Boy, Oshawott, Sneasel, I'm not going to focus anymore, is it? C dot. Drifloon, I need to refocus, come on. There we go. Drifloon, I see another break there. Apom, we have as Yan Mega Break, so that's pretty cool, pretty funky and cool there. Yan Mega Break is our reverse hollow, and then we have another Bastiodon, so Yan Mega Break was probably the more fun card there. Because uh, obviously we had a couple of Yan Megas to go with it, so another pull there. So that's what three breaks we've had. Yeah, three breaks. So the same amount as we had in Fates Collide. I would probably prefer EXs to breaks, to be honest, since obviously I'm not that bothered about playing the actual TTG game. So I'd probably rather, you know, 
get Pokemon cards I know, not the made up ones for this is cheap, but whatever. Another Persian here with a Flibaby. Is it Flibaby? No, yes, yeah, a Flibaby up in the top. There we go. Don't know what's happening there. Claw Fossil Anorith, Skip Bloom, Fungus, Bergmite, Joltic, Mantine, Clink, a reverse Dano, pretty cool there. Again, the Dragon has a really cool reverse card and a reverse holo card. Um, whereas like fire and that don't have anything on them, so and uh, the last guard of I think it's the last one. The last guard of our card from this set, and yes, you got it right. It's a secret rare, 116, 114, three guard of what sort of full arts, one mega guard of our full art. A normal God of War full art, and now the God of War secret rare. Aha! And the Evel is in the background, because Volcano has Xerneas in the background. That's really cool. I'm quite happy. The golden background kills me. Oh, that's so cool. Such a cool card. Oh, God of War always has the best cards. I spoke about this earlier, but why do they keep going God of War so much to do stuff? I don't know. Look, a Volcanian. He's like merged into the card pack. So I don't know what's going on there. But. I am, I'm probably pleased with what we've got now from this box, you know, um, was it free full arts? Um, yeah, free full arts, that's pretty cool. Free breaks, yes, maybe not as many EXs, oops, I've missed a card in this pack now. I missed a card, I need to take it out, there we are. This is a point where I find out I've been like lo losing loads of cards uh, in, in, in packs. Um, okay, I'll put this in the wrong place now. This probably goes here, I would say. Roll the cards again, but whatever, okay. We have a Holucha, Holucha, Anarith, Persian, Mareep, Mantine, Meowth, Lavesta, Fletchling, nothing too special. Reverse Lampant, that's pretty cool. And then we have a Volco. Wait. Huh, the card feels really funny. I don't know why. The card feels really rigid, uh, unlike other cards. Yeah, I don't know, maybe it's just a reverse hollow sort of print. I don't know, it feels really weird to me. And then a Volcarona again, we've had one of these before. Just a Volcarona, it's not going to focus, but yeah. That felt really, it feels really weird, I don't know why. Um, I don't know. It's just me having a funny five minutes, guys. Funny five minutes. So, how many packs are left? One, two, three, four, five, six packs left still, so... Maybe we'll get something else extra, you know. As I said, Pokemon EX is what we had the least of. We had like one or two. I mean, we had a couple. We had full art EXs, but we haven't had normal EXs. So it would be good to get one or two of those, since otherwise we have a load of those to get. Urgh, come on. Let's not even come out of the pack, you know. Won't come out of the pack, guys. We have a problem here. There we are. Out it comes. Haven't lost any cards this time, either. <laughs> so all good. So we have. And the Pom, or Lucha, the cards are not focusing again. And the Pom, or Lucha, and why is Lucha a normal type? What the fuck? Anarith, Apom, Larvesta, Dano, Chelus, Mankey, make sure I haven't lost a card there, Mankey, Reverse Fletchling, so, you know, pretty decent. And then we have, as our rare, a Drudigan again. I had Drudigans before, so nothing too special there. So, five packs left. I don't like counting down the packs, as I'm sure you know if you watched the last opening, um, but it's just something I do because I don't know why I'm a boring person, basically. It's the final countdown. That's basically how my life works. So, one, two, three. Pop that there. We have ourselves a Pokemon Ranger card again. Come on. Focus. There we go. It's a holding closer, apparently. Rapidash. Amber Palm. Nosepass. C Dot. Launcher, Bergmite, Yanma, Reverse Ponyard, pretty cool, and then we have ourselves Nido King. Yes, Nido King is a rare, uh, a card we haven't had before. Obviously, it's nothing too special. I would have preferred an EX, but Nido King is still pretty cool. Oh, I can't reach, put these cards down now. So there we go. All right, come on then, God of War. You know you want to give me a. I can't really ask the God of War pack for anything now because we have had. All the Guard of Wars, I think it's all the Guard of Wars at least. I'm pretty sure that's all the Guard of Wars and Steam Siege that we've had. Um, maybe there's a normal Guard of War EX as well. It's not a full art, probably actually thinking about it. But I'm trying to get these cards out, damn it. There we go. So hard, guys. My life is such a struggle sometimes. So we got Nidorino. Not going to complain. Pokemon Ranger. Oops. Rapidash hiding behind that. Marill. Yanma. Fletchling again, Mareep, and a Talonflame, hmm, 
Drifloon. Reverse Mantine, that's a pretty cool card. And then the rare is... Aha! Gardevoir EX! We literally have the last Gardevoir! Literally the last Gardevoir in this set we have. All four Gardevoir cards we have, and obviously they're all EXs. What the hell is going on? Um, yep, I asked for another EX, I got another EX, and it's another freaking Gardevoir. What the hell is going on? What the actual hell the heck a Rooney is going on here? I have no clue. I could not tell you. I am beginning to think this box is rigged, but, uh, I mean, you could tell me it's rigged, because, you know, obviously, I did cut the tops off the packs, so I haven't, you know, it's not like I open the packs on, on camera to show you guys. Uh, I'm not, uh, this box isn't rigged. I literally bought it in and just cut the tops off so I didn't have to open them all. Um, and I hope you guys believe me, because, like, <laughs> this is a pretty good pull. Um, special charge is not going to fit. There we are. Pretty cool there. Focus up here. Monferno. Nidorino. Meowth. Litwick, Hopip, Dano, Litleo, Leo's, and a uh, reverse Monfono rather. I haven't got one of those. Goes along the reverse Chimchar, and the rare is a Hollow Kling Clang. Pretty cool. Not gonna complain there. That looks pretty freaking sick. Goes along with the clinks and the clangs we've been getting. So, put that one over there. How many packs is left? Two packs left. Uh, we've had plenty enough, but I'm still wanting a Volcanion. I know we've had loads of Gardevoirs, but I still want a Volcanion, please. I'm asking you nicely, Pax. Um, you know, give me a Volcanion. The secret rare if you really want to, but uh, I mean, I'll settle for a, for a normal EX, um, which is also a full art, but whatever. Clang. There we are. Clang. There we go, finally. <laughs> Clang. Special charge again. Lots of special charges. Monferno. Hoppip. Nose pass once more, need around again, Litlio once more, Sneasel, Reverse Clink, I don't think we have Reverse Clink, I'm not too sure, I think we have Reverse Clang though, I'm not too sure though, uh, we have a Weavile, sweet, we have a Reverse Weavile and another Weavile, um, it's a rare, one pack left guys, you know which cards I want, or which, you know, which Pokemon I want to see on a card, come on, if I don't get one, it's literally just going to mean next month I buy another booster box, it's literally what it's going to mean. I mean, I probably would have done it anyway, um, but shh, shh, it's down to Volcano, okay, guys? It's his fault. So, Nuzleaf. Okay, Nuzleaf, there we go. That's better. Steelix, Spiralink, Clang, Tangela, Joltik, Arvesta, Rufflet, Ponyta, Reverse Joltik, and just a Samurott. Nothing special there. Just Freaking Samurott. What are you doing, Samurott? I wanted the Volcanion. Whatever. Whatever, Samurott. Whatever. But I'm not going to complain at all. Um, we have had some really good pulls from this booster box. I shall show them off them often to uh, I shall show them off to you now. Okay, so remember we started off with Magena EX here. Then we got ourselves our first full art, the Mega Gardevoir. EX, pretty freaking sick there. Then we moved on to get ourselves a claw. It's a break. He's fallen down already, so he wants to show off Mega Steelix EX, nice and shiny again. Moving on to the full art Gardevoir EX, 111 out of 114. Then we had another break, which was the Yanma, because you know who doesn't want a Yanma break. Then we had the Secret Rare, another Gardevoir EX, the Secret Rare, or one of the Secret Rares, or the packs pack, the other one being. There we are. Okay, the first, uh, one of the secret rares of the pack, the other one being Volcanion, which hopefully we'll get next time. Who knows? And then we finished off with, yep, you guessed it, another freaking Gardevoir. Four Gardevoir cards, one booster box, three of them being full art, one of them being a secret rare, all being the X's. This was a pretty sick uh, sick pack, sick box, guys. Um, I'm just trying to show you all the cards at once now. It's not going to go very well. But we had some pretty, pretty sick pulls there. If you enjoyed this video, guys, be sure to hit the like button. Let me know if you'd like, to, you know, that you'd like to see more boosting, booster box unboxings. As I said, probably do one a month um, since I need some Volcanian cards. So yeah, at least it'd be, it'd be a month, please, please. I hope it's a month. Who knows? But let me know if you want to see some more down below, guys. And smash that like button for all of these awesome cards, especially the full Gardevoirs, because you know Gardevoir loves me, guys. Gardevoir freaking loves me. So, that's going to be it for me for today. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to hit the like button. But for now, I'll be seeing you next time. Thank you for watching. Goodbye, my friends.